Hey guys, you know there is a saying, where, is, where there is a will, there is a way. So <laughs> I learned it, I relearned it again. So if you are doing calisthenics uh, like I do, uh, sometimes you will find that you don't have certain equipment that you need. Uh, for example, uh, if you've been watching this channel, you know that I've been practicing for uh, Bar Brothers representation training. I mean, I don't really... <clears throat> okay. <laughs> I'm, my primary goal is not to be, be a representative of Bar Brothers in Japan, but my goal is just basically to challenge myself. And uh, one of the requirements is doing 25 uh, parallel bar dips. And that is tough. And uh, that is like one of my biggest problems. And the reason it's a big problem for me is because I have no bars to train on. Like, it's just, if you don't have something to train on, you can't really become good at it. So what I decided to do is this. Um, I have a bar at home and uh, I have rings, uh, usual gymnast rings like this. <laughs> so, um, but the problem is this, my bar is in the hallway. So if I just hook up my rings to the bar, they will make the passage so narrow, well, not so narrow, they will basically just make it look terrible and not be convenient for everybody. Um, so to do that, that's the, <laughs> that's the source of the, where there is a will, there is a way. And my way is this. I bought a carabine, you see? And now I can hook up my rings to my bar and I can do uh, practice for parallel bars and uh, I don't have to go anywhere. Before I used to, uh, I had to go to a park or like some other place and it was ugh, 15 minutes one way, so it's half an hour. I'm just losing to get to uh, the bars and then of course I have to exercise and so I just have no time to do that. And uh, now I can do it in, <laughs> I can hook up this thing in like five, 10 seconds and I can just do that. And so here's the interesting thing. There is a good side effect of that is that rings are much more difficult than bars. I mean, cause the rings are flexible. So actually you have to balance and to balance what muscles do you use? You use the delts and uh, deltoid muscles will they are kind of like it's hard to train them without um, weights because you know they are used to raise uh, arms so if you are not using weights how do you raise your arms with like resistance or something but delts are really really important for muscle definition in your arms because you know like you might have like a huge biceps but then everything will look just like a big sack of <laughs> whatever uh, unless you get good deltoids to show that, you know, triangle between the triceps and the biceps, then uh, people will be like, oh, so that's not just a sack of shit, it's actually muscle. <laughs> uh, so deltoids will give you definition and the practicing on uh, the rings really activates the, del uh, the delts like nothing else I've seen uh, so far. And uh, I'm so happy. <laughs> so this is my lesson for today. Uh, my lesson, I don't know if this is a lesson for you, but anyway, this is what I've learned. If you really want to do something, you will find a way. And uh, when it comes to body weight exercises, you must do that. And there is, this is a way how to, you, how to simulate bars, parallel bars, on a regular <laughs> um, overhead bar. So guys, I hope this helped you, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.